Hello, I'm Ryan from Buster Beagle 3D. Today I'm making this short video to go over working with the original Buster Beagle 3D injection molding machine. Now for those of you following my channel, you know that it's only been around a very short time and thank you to the many of you for subscribing. As my channel grows, you may be surprised to know that I actually read all of my comments. All of them. While the vast majority are positive, there are a few negatives sprinkled in there, like this gem from two days ago. OMG, watching this video was so painful. There's a lot of O's in there. That was about a laser engraver comparison. Now I read everything really only because I truly try to answer questions or be helpful whether it be about injection molding, CNC, laser engraving, etc. I really just ignore the negative comments, but one that I've seen pop up a few times, which I'm more just perplexed by, is that I'm somehow hiding the work of the injection molding machine because they never show me pulling down the handle and there's no way that the machine can do what I say it does. Now, I'm no Spielberg, although I did work on his movie for almost a year. But I always shot my videos close to the part being made because I thought it was more interesting than to see me pulling down on the handle. So, if you ever wanted to see a wide angle, uncut video of me using the original Buster Beagle 3D injection molding machine, you're in luck. It's sped up to pair about 13 minutes down to six, but doesn't cut anything out. So hopefully this isn't so painful and only includes one more Spielberg reference. So let's get started. 